You see me? Hello. Hi. What's up, guys? <sighs> Jazz hands. Hey, it's Joe with Beard Giants. Started a little weird there. Sorry. Uh, I'm going to be doing a uh, kind of tutorial on kind of what I do in the morning. I was going to shoot a video on some beard wash that I got earlier this week, but uh, that didn't really work too well. Uh, if you hear any children in the background, that's my children screaming. I am in my bathroom, so and I got three kids that are loud and uh, like to tear things up. So I uh, got to show you what I do in the morning. I get out of the shower, damp it, uh, dry off my beard, blow dry, towel, whatever. Uh, then I go and I grab my beard oil. Boom, 1740, Fruit of the Groom. I uh, love this stuff, smells great. Uh, when you put this on, and then, look at that. Don't have the little droppers. See, this is this is where it's at right here. So you just take it and you take a little drop. Not very much. You don't have to do a whole lot. You don't have to go crazy with it. We're not trying to saturate your beard with this oil. We're just trying to get it in there and kind of work it in your beard. Best you can. Uh, I got my trusty wooden comb. Just going to comb it out. Kind of let the comb kind of work through your beard hair. Uh, move the oil around. Combing it down. Kind of getting to kind of where, what kind of shape you want it. And then, after the, see, baby crying. Then after the oil, I go to the beer balm. Love this stuff. This stuff holds my beard real well. Uh, they use a lot of wax. Uh, 1740 does in their beard balm. You know, whatever you think is best for your beard. It doesn't have to be this one. Get a little bit, not a lot, on your thumb. Scrape it. Ryan likes to take a guitar pick, which is awesome, that he got from a beard company. And he likes to, like, stab at it. Uh, not a big fan of that because you can get like a big chunk in one corner when you're about out and then it just swirls around and he's trying to get after it. So what I do, take my thumb, guitar pick if that what you have, it don't matter. Scrape it, put it on your palm just like you did the oil, rub it in, and just kind of work that through your beard just like you did the oil. Then you take your comb just like you did with your oil and just Brush it down, kind of get the shape that you want it. Yeah, just like that, perfect. Look at that. Boom. Magic. Now, people have different ways of doing it. Uh, you don't have to do it like how I do it. This is like most people, this is how they uh, beard oil, then brush it, beard balm, brush it, and you know kind of shape it to however you want it to be and uh, all this stuff that I'm using I'm going to put it in the description down below website uh, 1740 uh, along with the comb as well now like I said everybody has a different routine you can do it my way do whatever you want to now the amount of oil and the amount of beard balm that you use or whatever you're using it, it, it not a lot little you know less is more on them you don't want to use a whole bunch and, and saturate your, you know, if you got extra on your hand, don't go wiping it on a towel. You can put it on your arm. You got tattoos, you know, you can rub them on your tattoos or whatever. Put it in your hair. See, I don't got much hair, but you put it in your hair, you know, it smells great. So it works all, you know, all the same. Uh, but if you have any questions or any comments, uh, please leave them down below our videos. Like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thumbs up on our YouTube channel too on some of these videos. Watch all, we got quite a few videos. We try to get one out every week. Um, feel a little bit more comfortable with uh, every video we shoot. Um, with, it's, it's hard to do sometimes, when, you know, with Ryan's not here to kind of give, you know, back and forth feedback. They like and subscribe. Go on our, our Facebook, got a Facebook, got a lot of people like that. Um, thank you to everybody who's, who's liked our Facebook. A lot of updates on that. Also, Instagram I made about, I don't know, a couple weeks ago. Got a lot of followers coming through. Thank you to everybody who's following me on Instagram. Got 30 subscribers. Thanks, guys, whoever subscribed. Now, these subscribers are getting these videos 
notifications that we've made a new video and we put it out live for everybody to go watch. So, you know, you don't want to be the last person to know our videos out. I mean, that, this is just lame. So if you could, you know, not everybody's got a YouTube, make an account, subscribe to us, leave a comment, um, thumbs up on our videos. Um, if we're doing something stupid, let us know uh, and get to see our ugly faces all the time. And who wouldn't want that? And like I said, and more and more videos we're doing, the more we're getting more comfortable with these and we start being goofy and being ourselves and not so robotic like we were in our first video. Thanks everybody for watching. Hope you all have a wonderful day. And of course, be giant.